And Jeff Ray is in for Jeff Jameson this morning. Blizzard warnings stretched across the, the heart of the country, but snow yeah. isn't the only threat with powerful wind advisories here in Texas, too, right? Yeah, we're, the wind is not so bad here. We're far enough away from this low pressure system, this winter storm that can produce some heavy rains on the East Coast and then the continuation of the big snows across parts of Michigan. Look at the feel like temperatures right now in Minneapolis and Des Moines in the single digits in the wake of all that snow. Now they have really cold conditions. And it's warmer ahead of it. That's where the rain's going to be in Washington, D.C., and New York, and Boston. But this low pressure system is going to make its way towards Buffalo. You can see where the heavy rain now is in Pennsylvania. That's where the big snow is across Michigan, still snowing in Chicago. And as the low moves away, the heavy snow will become lake effect snow across the Great Lakes and also into the Appalachia chain where the East Coast will just get the big rain. Around here, we're still close enough to that low to get some good winds this morning. These north winds, the right now making the wind chills in the teens in some locations like in Denton, but feels like 20 degrees as you send those kids out the door this morning. We're still about an hour away from the sun getting to horizon. Good morning, Motley Elementary. Your bus stop forecast, temperatures start at freezing. Yes, a cold start to the day, but plenty of sunshine gets us into the low 50s for an afternoon high. All right, Jeff, thanks. You can have the forecast right across the, right across the globe, right at the palm of your hands. The free CBS DFW weather app has current conditions, as well as the hourly and daily forecast and live radar as well. So 